Hey guys, I'm here bringing you another video. Welcome back to more Season 11 content. We're playing some Ziggy Boy. Ziggy Stardust, as we would say. Uh, people in chat have been missing my Ziggs, and I think people on YouTube even enjoy it. So we're like, hell, let's go with it. Let's have a bit of fun, because that, again, that is the main thing that we're supposed to be doing when we're playing video games. I know it's crazy, and a lot of people in League of Legends will be like, what? But yeah, we're supposed to be having fun. So yes, I do want to climb. Yes, it's been going really rough for me right now. But I'm happy with how I'm playing, um, so I'm just going to play to have fun, and then hope the climb will come with that. Bringing up the Olo de Medudar, though, uh, bear with me. Uh, there we go. It is a low plat, uh, sorry, low diamond, high plat game. Godlike Udir, by the way. Udir top for some reason. Main band Echo, main. Screw you, one trick Echo. I got him, sorry. That's just, that's a good feeling. Cold Street Cassio, vulnerable lane as she dies. Unfortunately, Ziggs isn't really the best at killing people. Again, I have played one game of Ziggs. If you're wondering, Huz, what your one game of Ziggs you lost, you went 0 2 1. Yeah, this was the game we had a one trick Yumi player not get Yumi because the enemy team picked Yumi. And then they went team of support and proceeded to go 0 8 0 with basically trolling. So that happened. Godlike Sona, Seraphine Stomper. So you got the new version versus the old version. Kaisa main, Cold Streak. Doesn't play center AD carry, and you all know what I feel about uh, center AD carry. We've also got a really good Nunu, uh, so that's good to see. And again, they're a duo, so they are losing together. But hopefully it'll be good. Cold Streak as well, Janna. Winnable game, definitely winnable game. Um, but there are a bunch of world ranked people here uh, in this game, so it'll be good to see. Uh, Curry Craver 123, thank you so much, dude, for three months with Prime. I actually made, again, we're not sponsored by them anymore. Uh, again, the sponsorship may come back, but uh, the HelloFresh curry that I had, where well, we made it last night, and it was pretty good. Not not completely my dish. The, the prawn risotto was out of this world, but uh, yeah, it was good still. All right, so what am I worried about this game, if anything? Uh, I'm worried about the Kha'Zix more than most. I'm not really, again, I can't. I don't know what the hell Udyr Top does. I don't know if he wins the 1v1. I, I've got no idea. I, he's got exhaust. No idea. Uh, bot lane, I'm not... Well, again, I'm not a big fan of that. I'm normally not a big fan of that. But... She's a really good Sona. Do I recommend not playing on weekends? I normally recommend not playing on weekends, yes. Uh, yeah, I can W the Kha'Zix. And I should be able to keep an Udyr away. Uh, but we are playing this. I'm recording this on Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Um, mainly because I, I actually wanted to bring this up in this video. I had yesterday off. And I did something that I normally never do. And I would very much recommend it. And I felt I feel great today. And that is, I went for a walk. I went for a over hour long walk. And it was lashing down with rain. But I had my, I got, a, I got a new winter coat recently. It's really nice. So I had my new winter coat on. I had wellies. I had a bobble at, I had gloves, I was proper comfy, and I went on a walk, played a bit of Pokemon Go, and honestly, do it. Feel great. It's just, you know, I'm, I would consider myself healthy nowadays in shape, but I don't, I don't walk. And it was, it was honestly really good. So if you are wanting to, ah, all right. Calm down, bud. You have no mana anymore. Wahaha. Remember, I've got TP, so I actually don't mind taking that. It's not the worst situation if she doesn't kill me now. But that's what Cassius can do at level 2. It's a fairly known thing. The Cassio level 2 all-in. Is this ranked? Yes, it practically is always ranked. Oh... <sighs> no, I, there's no point flashing from that. Nunu's pinging my flash. I would have just been flashed on anyway and killed. I'd rather save my flash. I'd rather save the flash. This is the first game of the day? Yep, first game of the day. Hey, first cannon of the day. OPGG. Oh, um, again, Kazakh's very strong champion right now. 
Some people actually think he think he's obnoxiously strong. I don't think he's obnoxiously strong. Like I don't think he's echo level, for example, but I think he is good. So we just need a mid lane to calm down a little bit. Unfortunate gank by Kazix on me, but it happens. But this Cassio is very aggressive. She should be able to get punished for it, but we'll see. Uh, Holo Dista, thank you much, dude, for the nine months tier one. Okay, I'm not expecting a Senna to do very well. I just don't rate the pick as AD carry. Would I play Echo? No. Maybe a good new new gank. Oh no, bad new new gank. Oh dear, bot lane's losing really badly. Yeah. Oh boy. I think we have a better combo later. It's just, do we get there? Hopefully, Nunu just takes the objectives. If he can't do well in the early with ganks, then if he gets the objectives, then at least we scale. Which isn't bad. Would you ever take Dark Harvest on Ziggs? Probably not. The reason, if again, the reason why I love Ziggs as a champ, why don't you main Ziggs or is he not in your main champion pool? Set of our ages, he's really inconsistent. You will probably see it this game, like within this game. I might do well on Ziggs and I might be okay with like aiming, but if you miss by a millimeter of your Q and it just bounces over the target, it's the worst feeling on Ziggs in the world. Other, other, like, mid laners are so, so much more clear of when you're actually landing your skill shots. So that's, I think, one of the major problems with this champion. I think Coda is saying in chat that because I'm good as a player, I, I, I handicap myself by not taking the cannon minions. Yep, that's definitely, that's definitely why I don't take the cannon minions. I was walking down there to get the Cassio's attention back because Nunu's doing dragon. I really didn't want Cassiopeia to go over to the dragon. <laughs> so even if it meant Cassio would like full engage on me, I'd actually be okay with that because I want... Oh no! That's really bad. Yeah, we're getting absolutely wrecked. Nunu, as a champion that is built all around getting dragons and objectives... Got out smited. Oh dear. Well, this is a very bad start. This is this has been kind of how my games have been going recently. Um, yes, we obviously have died this game and have not played it perfectly, but not feeding. I uh, got ganked and that's how I died. Um, but yeah, I don't really know what I can do overall, to be honest. Um, this this is just this is it. Udi is now invading our jungle. He's also over quite a lot of farm up. Um, yeah. <laughs> That's why, again, I'm just trying to focus on having fun. Because if I focus purely on winning right now, I think I would lose my mind because I just can't seem to get wins. Hey, we're on the board. There we go. We got a, we got a kill. The team got a kill. Da, 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 da. Oh. It's Seraphine. Okay, let's go back. I still don't like Seraphine as a champion. Don't worry. I, but I, to be fair, I don't think I'm ever going to like her as a champion. Oh, Oktoberfest. I like that skin. Is he going tank, Gragas? I hope he is. Well, he should be. He's gone, he's gone grasp. That's a squishy you dear. Don't think he should have flashed. I'm pretty sure he's dead. Unless Kha'Zix is there at the exact right time. Which he's not. 
Yeah, this is Hextech. We don't know which the next tech. Wait, do we know what the next Hextech is? I don't think so. Getting zoned. She she beats me in a 1v1 right now. Senna's dead again. 0-3 Senna AD carry, everybody. Oh, God. I, I never get good Senna's. And 1-3 and three, Nunu. Help. And now I can't do anything to the Cassio because Kha'Zix is 100% like probably above me. Maybe even doing Rift. And the Cassio is just holding the lane here. So much damage. And Seraphine's there anyway. God damn. I couldn't flash because I was on her W, for those that are wondering. Yeah, we're just getting stopped. Not the best first game of the day. Uh, this is generally how my games are going anyway, though. So, I'm not too surprised. I've just kind of accepted that Solo Q sucks on me right now. Which is whatever. It happens. Why is Seraphine? Oh, I guess Seraphine is allowed to live here because bot lane's lost so badly. Got her. She's being really cocky. This cast just is looking for an all-in any moment she can, by the way. Honestly, what Sona's doing, I think, is the correct thing. The center is useless right now, so you may as well just, like, go help the team. But yeah, it doesn't feel great in mid. Um, I, if I go anywhere near this Castio, she's just going to go all in. And I think you guys can see, no matter how I play, we ain't winning the 1v1 right now. This Seraphine is living in mid lane, by the way. I don't know why. I can. I think there is a duo on both teams, but I can't. Yeah, Seraphine is in that, I think. I'll check in a sec. Um, Seraphine is duo with... Oh! <laughs> Seraphine's duo with the Cassiopeia. I never would have guessed that. Wait a minute. Maybe now I now I know why the Seraphine is always mid. <clears throat> why isn't he pulling it out? He just had he had the first dragon stolen from him because he's not wanting to pull the dragon out. Second time in a row. This is basic jungling. He should never lose that to the Kazakhs, by the way. It's a Nunu. Okay. Neither jungler got that. That Kazakhs damage. Holy. Our bot lane is so weak. There's just no chance of winning this game. That was a 4v5. Udis just staying top lane. This is the problem when you just don't have an AD carry. Oh my god. I just don't get what center AD carry is supposed to do. I never see them do anything. They always lose lane. I never see them win lane. God damn, man. <sighs> nope. 
Ezra just can 2v1 them without much of a problem. The new Cho skin. Yeah, looks pretty good. Did you see Zig's damage is good? It's just can you land the damage or not? That's the problem. That's ballsy. The Nunu's invading a five and one Kazakh. Hmm. We do scale quite well, but I just don't know if we can actually get there or not. At least we got that dragon. That's good. What map is it? It's the wind map. Okay. Um, divine. This is is divine Sunderer, by the way, too strong? Because a lot of the champions that seem to be issues right now use divine Sunderer. Lane's dead again. <clears throat> one and six, one and five. This is, again, I might upload this because it is highlighting what currently is going on in my solo queue games. Like, yeah, like, I'm behind my lane opponent, but you can clearly see, like, Seraphim has been mid lane a lot this game, so I'm just trying to survive. This is every game. My bot lane right now, in combination, is two and 11 at 15 minutes. That This is my solo queue games. I don't really know what I can do about it. If I'm completely honest. Because it feels a little bit pointless. And that's again why I'm trying to focus on just having fun. <clears throat> uh, Akith Gaming, preparing to start your rank season tomorrow in the jungle, getting my tank champion pool ready, but now you need your final alternative in case a tank is not a good choice. I'd recommend Echo. <laughs> And Senna's dead again. She's trying to fight a Fed Ezreal, by the way. So yeah, I might upload this video uh, because I, I know sometimes in the YouTube audience, because obviously I don't upload most of the poop games, you guys sometimes feel like we don't know what's technically going on at the moment. So I'll upload this just to kind of show you this is how my games have on average been going. It's games that I've got a really badly feeding... Um... Re He's good to go. Really bad feeding bot lane. And we just lose the game, you know. It's unfortunate, but that's just usually what's happening. And then I get frustrated, so then I'm like, alright, I'm gonna go I'm gonna go be the support this game, and usually I do quite well on support, but then my top lane feeds. <laughs> and again, it's it's nearly comedic with how like accurate that is. Um I could go through my match history and explain it, but you know. Hopefully you guys just trust that what I'm saying is true. I guess I push out top because I've got TP. Pete, again, he never pulls the dragon out of the pit. That, again, is very basic stuff. Oh, he's finally done it. He's done it, everyone. He's pulled the dragon out of the pit. It just makes it a little bit harder for someone to steal. Would I say Ziggs is a good champ to main? I never like answering that the main question because maining is personal. Do you enjoy the champion? If so, main it. Are you good at the champion? Main it. Maining is the personal like, do you enjoy this for your video game experience? Would I say Ziggs is a ch good champion to climb in solo queue? No. But that's where maining isn't to do with something being good necessarily. Maining and one tricking and that type of thing is enjoyment level. Or it should be. Why isn't he a good champ for climbing? Yeah, too inconsistent. He's a very inconsistent champion. As I said, like you can just miss a little skill shot and you you know it, you feel like you're hitting them, but you're like you just miss it and you're like, oh. Other champions are a bit 
I don't know, they're more forgiving in their skill shots. You know, like some champions like Morgana, their hitbox is insane. You're like, dude, that bind didn't hit, but then it ended up it did. Ziggs' hitboxes are very, very not forgiving. Jesus. I don't know if I... Like, I didn't want to flash for that, but... Anything we can do just to slow down the enemy team, I think, is good. Yeah, it's a very small hitbox, and the bounce mechanic is also a little bit... So adding those things together, I just don't think he's consistent enough to like be a really reliable champion to climb with. But if you enjoy it, and you think you're good at it, play it. So again, some people say Seraphine is basically just the better version of Sona. This game is kind of showing that, but I also think bot lane was at a disadvantage with the center in it anyway. I actually played that really well. Go, donk him! Donk. Again, I did say we do outscale the enemy team, everybody. Rich! Rich! Gonna buy orb and just leave it there. Gonna buy Death Cap or Lich Bane next. I think Udyr could be still going top, yeah. That, to me, was quite obvious. What was that? So is she trolling? She might actually be trolling. The way that she just played that, I would say she's trolling. She just burnt her ability and just stood in place. Oh, it's always me. Who gets the troll? Hey, we're ready to battle. Whoa. They're not actually doing it. They could do Baron soon, though. I'm trying to carry. Again, I'm going to upload this video, everybody. Because, as I said, I'm playing okay. I'm not playing amazing, but I'm playing fine. And this also is showing the YouTube audience, especially. The stream audience, you guys are seeing every day. But this is how my league games are going. My bot lane, by the way, in combination, has died 18 times in 22 minutes. That's a lot. And that is... That's about average, I'd say. Oh. That was really bad. That Gragas got us killed. Yeah. That Gragas actually got us killed. Oh, no. Well... The only way that Greg Assault would have been worth if the Cassiopeia got one shot. And if you notice, I ulted, which would have killed probably the Cassio, and he ulted her away from it, I think. That's unfortunate. Uh, Purple Ghost 2, 10 months tier 1. Appreciate it, appreciate it. I don't think Nunu can get in to steal. I'm going to wait for a bit of gold.
Nunu's dead. <sighs> I pressed the wrong button. Yes, I did just zombies. Oh, who did? Wait, was he just chilling in our base the whole time? Help! <laughs> Dudes, like, I, look how much pressure I have, and I was actually doing a lot of damage to them as well. Can we not kill them now? Maybe. Ah! Yeah, if you appreciate the video anyway, everybody, please do throw a like on the video. Um, again, I, I'm uploading it just to show how it's going. Um, this is why we went from Diamond Promo to Platinum 2. And again, I, I like, I hope people know, I'm not over-exaggerating. This is genuinely how the games have gone, is I have an okay game. I'm playing average, I'd say. And my bot lane's died 21 times. That That's, that's league for me right now. So, you know, I'm still trying. Still trying to keep PMA, positive mental attitude, as much as I can. Yes, it's frustrating, but oh well. At the end of the day, it's a video game. Hey, Rez. No blue buff. Code has been doing a running commentary in chat the whole game. I think code is broken. But yeah, this this game is also quite a good example of like I like Ziggs, but I don't think he's a great hyper carry, I guess is the word. Like some mages, if they get if they do well, they can win you the game, right? I don't think Ziggs does that particularly well. I think, oh, other mages definitely can do it better. The one, the one thing I will say, and uh, she's dead again. The one thing I will say and give um, Ziggs, he's quite good at delaying games like Anivia is. They're just too fed for me now. And that's, that's again, that's what happens. Enemy team gets fed from other people, and then they're too strong for me to do anything to. But yeah, anyway, that's going to be the game. Um, it shows how it's going at the moment. I'm trying to play fine. I think I am playing fine, but I can't help with my bot lane. Black lane has died 23 times, and that is, on average, that that's how my games have been going. Like that, that is. I know people will go, "Oh, that's a bit weird, isn't that?" You know, that, that's the norm of how my games are going right now. That that is how it's going. So, yeah. Oh, well. Uh, we only... Again, our MMR, by the way, worth knowing, is still in a really good place. We're only losing 11. We're still gaining 2021 LP. But we go 976, 170 farm, and damage-wise, dealing the most damage of my team and in the mix of the enemy team's damage as well. But, um, yeah. I, I, don't, I don't really know what to do or say. Um, it, it's unfortunate, but I'm just... Again, I'm now used to this. That This is just, again, the typical solo queue games that Huzzy Games has right now. But uh, anyway, if you enjoyed it, nonetheless, please do throw a like on the video, comment down below. Let me know how your season's going. Are you having the same thing or not? I don't know. But uh, yeah, like, comment, subscribe. See you guys next time. Peace.